You have to do this one thing. Yes. If you don't know what I'm talking about, the Xbox 360 store is shutting down in a couple days. After a long, nearly two decades of running, the Xbox 360 store is sadly shutting down in July 29th of this year, so Monday. And it's really sad to see. But there's a couple games that you may want to pick up. So might as well pick them up when you have a chance. Or you can wait and get the physical disc or whatever, physical media, because the store is going to shut down and the games are probably going to rise up in price because you can't get them anymore unless you get them through game pass that's a whole different story so what are you gonna do are you gonna go back on the store browse through and look through games maybe you want to get those games connect to your microsoft account that you have on your xboxes or your, your xbox one because like you'll have to save dollar dues that you have there anyways anyways so make sure that you pick up the games that you're really, really interested in. Games that you know may never come back or you'll never see them again. Games that you think are not even on the Game Pass and you really love these games, you know? For for example, I really love Forza Horizon 2. For some reason, I just thought that game was really, really good. It was really well polished and amazing. For the Xbox 360, dang, that game looked amazing. Yes, I know, it didn't come out in the early life of the Xbox 360. It kind of came out in 2014. I'm reading that right? Whatever. 2014 for Xbox. To, yeah, anyways. So, do you think that you're going to pick up some games? There's a whole lot of fun, classic games. But if you look at the market value, such as ebay but i don't even really buy things that much from ebay or at all i don't know why we're looking at the market value here but anyways you can see two to nineteen dollars that can't be right no i can see half these games in a hawk shop or whatever you call them where you're from in canada and they're like five dollars each or even cheaper no this can't be right look at these prices what five dollars for fable 2 anyways 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 yeah call of duty modern warfare 7 um yeah there's a whole lot of great games and they'll probably go up and up and up price and you'll never see them again when the store closes so make sure that you get the game that you want before the store closes because I think I would be pretty sad if there's a game that I really, really want and I can't ever get it again. And like, that would suck. And yes, I know there's gonna be some comments saying, just emulate the game or something. It's not the same. If I wanna plop in a disc, take up my Xbox controller, flip on the TV and play the game, I think that's just like the best option instead of going to a sketchy website, downloading some sketchy thing, putting it on a, I don't even know how you do it. But anyways, you put it on something and then you're able to play an Xbox game through your computer. I think that's how that works. I don't know, but playing the original hardware is so much better. So if you like your Xbox 360 and you find it the, a great, great console, do it some love. Buy some games that you know that you'll play and will never be forgotten because you got them. So, what do you think? Are you going to buy some Xbox 360 games? Are you going to leave the Xbox 360 to just go all the way? Come on. Anyways, are you going to, I don't know, pick up a couple fun games like... Um, um, Forza 2. That's the one. That's the one I was looking for. Forza 2 is a great game, actually. It looks fantastic. I can barely tell it apart from Forza 2 to Forza 3. Like, it's really, really close. 
really enjoy that game. Yeah, try to pick that up. If you haven't picked that up, trust me. If you're into car games and you like just racing around or a track or being free to do whatever the heck you want, that's a game that you might want to pick up because it's just a cool, fantastic game. I don't know. You may, you may like it. So consider picking up that game. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed. And, um, you know, it kind of sucks to see that the Xbox 360 store is shutting down. So give it some love by at least picking up one game that you know you'll like and cherish. If you don't use your Xbox and it's rotten in the closet, that's fine too. But make sure that if you like the game, the store is coming or the store is shutting down this Monday. So July 29th, 2024. Make sure that you got um, three days. Three days to get any game that you want, essentially. So yeah, with that being said, I hope you enjoyed. I hope that maybe you subscribe if you want. Hope you have a fantastic day. With that being said, see you in the next one.